drunk, isn't it? No one gets it, you know. <laughs> My nose, my nose. up, doesn't it? Hey guys, so a bit of a different start to a vlog. So I am at Studley Royal or Studley Gardens, I can't remember what it's called. Um, and I um, haven't filmed guys for such a long time and I say this every time and it's the truth um, I've just recovered from Covid so that's why I sound really nasally really congested um, also I've had my nose done I've had a um, liquid rhinoplasty and it's so cute it like sticks up um, Guys, so much to tell you. I don't even know where to start. I'm probably going to do this vlog and then I'm going to do like a sit down video towards the end just so I can talk to you about everything. Um, I'm kind of, I look a bit weird today, I don't know. Uh, yeah, so I've had my hair done as well, guys. I've gone, I've gone lighter. I've gone more blonde. I don't know if I should have done or not. I feel like I'm regressing it now because I quite like being dark, but I'll be fine. Um, so yeah, I am, um, we need to go now actually because I'm waiting because um, I'm coming. I don't want him to. So, yeah. Let's get on our way. Curled my hair today. So, I'm going to do a bit of vlogging. Um, kind of got a bit of a fringe going on, but. Oh, it's not working. Let's go. Hey, guys. Really gorgeous weather today. Wearing a necklace. My nose, guys, are in love. So we're in Fountains Hall now. Never been here before. It's like a big. It's like um, the Rolf family kind of own it, I think.
a little um, like a living room. thinking that this like brutal day it's got love on it It's really frothy. Break. The view is just incredible. Zoom in. Oh, wow.
JK Row, Lane Front. What do you think I should have? I'm going to get a cocktail. Get a few on <laughs> Chapter two. I don't know what anything even it is. Name it. It's Amaro Monte Montegrano. That looks nice. Like a prosecco y. Amaro Montegrano Basil Orange Prosecco. Chocolate, maraschino. That looks nice. It's the hide. Look at that squid ink. Oh I saw that God. one. Yeah. Mm. Why don't you get that? Good. That looks nice. Havana three-year lime and mint. It's rum. Oh, is it? Mm. What's that? Oh. Tequila. I don't even know. What should I do? Oh, It looks lovely, that colour, doesn't it? Mm. Yeah, I agree. Go for that one. It's Italian liqueur. Is it? Like orange? Include vanilla, orange peels, and you Oh, vanilla's taste. nice, because I like vanilla stuff. Hey? Okay. What's what you've been doing? What are you drinking? PSM. PSM. Guys, PSL. Everyone's going about the PSL. Let me just put my phone a bit. Hi, guys. It's time for a video. Now, someone please tell me how long it's been since I made a video because I um, can't even explain anymore. Hi everyone! Wow, my fucking hands are all baked. Hands great. How is everyone? I am back, and this is a continuation from the video in the beginning. Um, 
the video that I just, uh, oh my God, help, I look awful. This is a con continuation from the video that I put, obviously, be before this. Um, obviously, because you've seen it afterwards. Uh, oh, my God. So, hi. I am back. Just checking. I've got lips to come to you. I am back, and I, um, I don't know what to say, guys. It's been so long again. Like, I think the vlog before, the bit before was me going to... What's it called now? I've forgotten it again. What's the place called again? Uh, guys, I think I've got too much contouring on the nose. What's it called again? I forgot what it's called. Oh, guys, I'm going to have to put it on the screen. I don't know. <sighs> Where was I've just been? Grantley Hall, right? Okay. So, just me, um, earlier on the week, this, it, it's, it's now Tuesday, guys, and I have come back from Grantley Hall, obviously. Um, this is a PSL, pumpkin, pumpkin spice latte. I've got a bit of a mukbang for you today, guys, as well. Not a bit of, yeah. Kind of a little mukbang, but not, I want to try some stuff from you, from Starbucks that's brand new. So, I'll be doing that a bit later in the video. I'm all over the place. I haven't spoken to you in so long, guys. I've had my hair done again. I am now a bit blonder. Um, not too much blonder, but quite a bit blonder, as you can see. I kind of needed to kind of refresh. I can't like my hair like... I needed to refresh a bit because I felt like that... Um, I needed to refresh because I just felt like my hair was just getting so dull and disgusting. So bear with me, guys. It's been a while since I actually sat down with you. So kind of all over the place. Um, got a new vape as well. This is the rechargeable one because they're actually getting rid of um, normal vape. So I thought I'd get this before they all kind of go out of fashion and isn't, you can't get any vapes. I have had my nose done. I told you in, earlier in the video <clears throat> that I've had my nose done. Um, it's only a liquid rhinoplasty. It's not full nose job. And I mean, look at it. It just goes up. That's, that's all I wanted. I wanted the tip to just slightly go up and this to be a bit more slimmer. And she did it. I'm really happy. I am honestly out of the... Out of the out, why is my hair now gone into like a, a fucking... <sighs> Why has it gone away for you again? <clears throat> I literally cannot believe I got away there. Great. Guys, that pillow doesn't look right to me. So, does that look okay? Guys, I've got so much to tell you in this video. Like, I can't even believe how much I've got to tell you. Um, I don't know where to start, to be honest. Let me start right at the beginning. So, let's talk about my nose first. So, I look very fat. I want to let you know that, guys. Okay. No, let's start with the PSL because I'm sorry, but it is now autumn and it's PSL season. I'm very excited for PSL season. Um, are you excited for PSL season? Can't, I just can't fucking sit still. That is really annoying me, that, like, the wave there. Didn't have that five minutes ago. Now I've got it. Fucking great. So, PSL season. Mm, just got a um i have to say guys very very sweet <clears throat> very sweet so just be warned because um my hair looks shit really shit now i look fat as well oh great i better look fat when i edit it it's just when i look at, look at myself now like, the more you look at yourself the more you can like pick yourself like if someone's got like body dysmorphia i think the worst thing you can do is actually do vlogging or something because you're looking at yourself all the time I just feel like I'm getting flatter by the minute. I did have a little fringe, guys, but kind of hasn't worked out. Um, I kind of wanted it like this, yeah, like a fringe but not fringe. That's how I wanted it to be like. So you can you can still see it. And by the way, guys, I I don't even know where to start. I filmed like two videos which I haven't even put up because um, 
I've just been like, just not like in the right frame of mind to do it. I've just been completely like at work, um, caught up on life. You know how life is. Life is busy. My life's, even though I don't do a lot, it's busy because I'm doing, I'm working a lot. Like, do you know what I mean? So, and it takes up like all, all your time working, as people know. So that actually work and not sit on the internet and troll people. <laughs> so, um, oh my God, I can't look at myself. What is going on? Can you just, I, I need to stop now. My hair, it looks like shit. This is not funny right now. Okay, so no, what, what was I gonna, oh guys, I, I can't even think straight. I was talk. why is that moving like that? Can I even put my arms on this for it not to move? Great. Ten minutes, I haven't talked about anything. So, I like my hair like this at the minute. So I, um, I don't know what to say. I look like a wax work. I don't know what the fuck, I look awful. <laughs> It's fucking gorgeous. Right. Let me know if you've tried a PSL. Um, it's an ice one, though. I, do, I prefer ice stuff than, like, not. So, my nose, absolutely love. It's so cute. So subtle, but you can tell. It's, like, it cinches in a bit. And, obviously, I've been con I'm contouring now as well, so just to kind of emphasise it a bit more. Um, I've had my nails done, like it's kind of creamy white. It's not full white, even though it looks white on the camera. It's like a beige nude. You can't really tell it looks, it looks white on the camera. Um, my hair is blonder. There we go. Is that too loud? That's a lovely thumbnail, isn't it? Oh, I love that. I'm not taking... Why are these on? Oh, take it off. Oops. I like this. Fucking love this. <laughs> Can you hear me? Is it too loud? Anyway, so... That's a lot better, actually. Let me just make it... Three. I like the wind there like that. It's quite like Bridget Bardot, like. <laughs> Fuck! <coughs> I feel like I'm kind of, I'm, oh my God, guys, I haven't even told you anything about my life literally at the minute, like since like a month ago, since, since I uploaded the video. I uploaded a video um, to say that, basically, I am still going to upload it, but it's quite old now, obviously, it's about three weeks old. I uploaded a video just to say that I was going to go, was going to go, was going to Ibiza, which I did go to Ibiza, and I had a really good time. Um, something quite bad happened in Ibiza, though, guys. Um, I will talk about it. Um, but I don't want to get flagged or anything because I don't know what the community guidelines are like on here now. So I don't want to kind of get like into trouble, but um, yeah. So I so obviously in Ibiza there's a lot of drink involved, and I took a bad turn in Ibiza, and that's all I'm going to say for the bad turn. Um, I'll let you guess the rest, and kind of experienced a really bad turn, and I I thought I was going to die literally. So that really really ruined my time there towards the end. Um, a few other things happened as well, but the main thing was Ibiza. Like, it was a, I, I absolutely loved Ibiza. It was amazing. Like, I can't believe I was there, like, in, like, walking. Like, in, I just can't. I, it was like a blur. It's a blur to me. It, feel, it feels like a blur. It was five days I was there, but it feels like a blur. Like, it wasn't actually, it didn't actually happen. I was wrecked for the majority of the time there, to be fair. That's probably why. Um, we did. We were in San Antonio, Antonio, 
and Tony. And I just had a ball. I really did have an amazing time. Apart from the end bit. But I was really glad to be back. I just And then when I got back, I ha I've had COVID, guys. I've literally had COVID. So I've been recovering from COVID. I'm literally, I'm now just, just getting back. Just recovered now from COVID. So I've had COVID. Um, I was so incredibly ill, guys. I can't even explain. I was like shaking in, in, in bed. Um, like hot sweats. Like just, it was awful. Like never experienced such a bad time ever. Like seriously. Um, oh my God, guys. If you would, if you'd have been there, you'd be like, what the fuck? I thought, I actually thought I was about to die. Um, and then I got back, tested positive for COVID. I had that for like three days. I'm still not all there with my taste. It's still not there. Like, it still needs to come back. Like, um, I'm now not as... The nasally has gone. The, the, like, kind of congestion's gone. I had congestion for, like, two weeks. Um, guys, it was a fuck. Like, I've never had COVID. Like, never in my life I've had COVID. And I was, like, really proud of it. I was, like, telling everyone, oh, my God, I've never had COVID. Never had COVID. And then I come to England, I come back from uh, Spain, from Spain, and I have COVID. So it was going to happen because obviously there's a new strain. And um, I was literally like with thousands and thousands of people. Like we went to like amnesia, we went to all the, amnesia was like so packed, like couldn't even breathe. That's when I started to have like, a panic attack in amnesia. Am amnesia, that's what it was, when everything just went wrong. And I was like in the toilets, like just literally like, hallucinating to, with my friend like it was a fucking nightmare god i was so do you know when you're like abroad and you just want to be home you know you don't feel well when you're abroad and you just, all you want to do is be home it was bad guys like really bad um but i just genuinely didn't think i was gonna get better i was shaking like i was ha when i was sleeping in bed i was like, i have to shake my leg to kind of sleep because i would just distract myself from like the pain like my head was like impounding itself it was so bad <laughs> really really bad so yeah i've got a video to that um to put out to say that i'm getting ready for ibiza which i'm gonna put out and then there's another video of uh oh my god like it, it's really old it's like two, three months old um i went to someone's graduation so that is something I need to upload as well. So I've got some kind of old content to put out. So yeah, it's been a bit of a, it's been a bit of a fucking tough few weeks, to be honest with you guys. Um, seriously, it was fucking scary and I'd be there when I, I just absolutely, I did have a ball and I can't believe I was there. It feels like a blur. Like, I can't believe I was in another country. Like, it was just like a different a different life. It's a different experience. Being in another country, apart from where you live, there's nothing like it. I can't, I can't even put my fucking elbows here because it just moves. Why is this happening to me right now? Being in another country is honestly... I can't stop looking at myself because I look fat. Being in another country is like, look at my third chin. Oh, great. I'm so fat, I can't breathe. Okay. Well, I can't just be like that all the time. Um, being in another country was just, oh my God, walking through like, it was so hot, but actually, it was actually hotter in England. Um, we were having a heat wave when we weren't away, like, what are the chances of going away? And fucking heat wave. Oh, right. So a week before, it was torrential downpour. Um, it was like raining horrifically bad. Like, wow. Like, we, like me and my friend went to like two events. And I will literally nearly die. No, no, no. Went to two events. And it was literally thunder fucking storming. Like, horrific. Um, like piss went through, like on the doing these like festival events. As soon as we hop off, hop on the plane, easy jet to Spain, the fucking um, gods open full of fucking sun, and it's like 30 degrees, and it's like 26 degrees in fucking Ibiza. 
all right yeah thanks that's really nice thank you for doing that uh, and then when we get, got back, it was like even even hotter. I nearly died when I literally said, oh my God, going back home, I literally was about to fucking self-combust. I literally said, some woman from like Ibiza was like, had to like go over like a um, barrier, not a barrier, like, you know, like those things that like secure so they don't, people don't go over the, under them. Well, I, my friend went under them because we couldn't get through. Like, what, what are you doing? What are you doing? I was like, do you know what? I'm not in the fucking mood. I literally died last night, I felt like saying to her. So, <laughs> it was bad. It was so bad. All right, so that looks like shit. Anyway. Oh, who's that? Oh, God. Is that someone I know? Sorry, guys. Anyway, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have something to eat now. I want to try the new Starbucks fucking food. <laughs> I want to try something new, guys, with you. Um, how fucking amazing is my nose, by the way? Can you let me know in the comments how much you like the nose, to be honest with you guys? Because I really need to know. Ooh, do you remember when I used to do that, guys, when the food used to be like that? <laughs> with, the, with, the, with, the, with the effects. I used to love that. Oh, God. Right, those were the days, weren't they? Right, so we're trying some um, Starbucks food. Um, why not so bad late? Oh, no. Right, so we've got... Shout out to my friend Brandon, by the way, because he um, had this on his story and I thought I have to try this on Instagram. So we're going to try something. Oh my God. This is the sweet potato and pumpkin seed fritter wrap. It's brand new. And let's do a mukbang. Shall I get some crisps out as well? Okay. Got some Doritos. I wish I could put you down a bit. I don't like this. Right, guys. So I'm going to try. In America, these are chili wrap heat waves. They're not called this, are they, in America? They're like a different name. And like the cheese ones in America, they're like, they're called like a different name, isn't it? What is it? Like. The nacho cheese ones are like, it's a different name. Um, and the, we've got Cool Ranch we have here. They're called Cool. No, are the ranch, or is it cool? Anyway, it's a bit different in America with like the, the names and like, the colours of the bags. Let me know. So, and then I got the new cake pop. Caramelised biscuit cake pop. Why do I look so bad? I don't know what's going on. I literally want to throw up today. Great. And do you like my new sofa, guys, by the way? I don't care anymore. I've had enough. Too fat. I'm actually quite sick of this hair now. Right. This is the cake pot. Everyone's been talking about it. It's all over TikTok. This is the caramelised biscuit. So we're going to do a fucking mukbang. I'm not doing the cover like that because I'm not... I'm not doing it anymore. Um, but I'm not, this isn't, by the way, guys, this isn't a muck, well, it is a muck bang, but this is what I would eat, like, never really tomorrow. <laughs> I, you know, I'm still, but, but I obviously, even though, I, it's like, I would say, I've still, when I say I've, I'm still back in my eating disorder, it's consistent, it's always the same, like, I never, it never changes, like, I'm, I've had this since I was 19, so, um, I just, like, I remind you guys that I have it, which is weird, because... You know, I'm just letting you know. I don't know why I have to explain myself all the time. Like, everything's got to be justified. Uh. Yeah, so, um, I would eat this, like, normally. Well, I would, because it's healthy. So, I haven't got, gone back to being a fat cunt that's eating shit and, like, doing all that again. Like, that's not me. Why? I don't like that wooden thing there. I fucking hate stuff like that. Like, peeping out. Makes me feel sick. Mm. 
Right. This isn't even in focus. I'm about to have a breakdown. Apparently it's like amazing. Like my friend said it's like part of this world. Let's give you a look of it. Mm -hmm. That looks really good. It's quite thick. It looks quite you get quite a lot in this. Oh my god. Cheers. Mm. It's all right. I got the dry bits in the beginning, so it's a bit weird. Not bad. Mmm. It's nice. It's not, it's not amazing. I'm not blown away by the way, but it's nice. I hate condensation of fucking glass. What is that? Mm, it's all right. I wish I could see what I'm eating. It would help, wouldn't it? Is that better? I've got like a huge chin now. It's not amazing, guys. Mm. So it's not, it isn't like wow, but. in this i don't like this angle sorry i'm rich it's, so... it's something about it is not speaking to me <laughs> i don't know what it is it's like sweet potato is quite tasteless anyway isn't it and then so is pumpkin i think there's nothing like that's like zingy it needs like a salsa Butternut squash and pumpkin seed fritter, pickled vegetable slaw, hummus, crushed sweet potato, three chili sauce, and spiced tomato dressing. Um, I can't taste any of that. Maybe this one's gonna be different. This looks different to me. Try this one. You know, it's the same thing. <laughs> Mm. Oh my god! Mm. This is completely different. This has actually got the slaw in it. Do you have any of it in the other one? What the fuck? It's way nicer. Okay, I, I get the hype now. Mm. Oh my god! Yes! That 
tastes completely different. What? Yes, guys, I get the height now. Yeah, it's the slaw that makes it. Oh, crush. Definitely the slaw that makes it. This is lovely. I don't even see. <laughs> I'm full. Really full. So, let me try the cake pop. I don't, my, do you know how many times I've touched my hair today? I haven't explained it. The legendary cake pop, a lot of people on TikTok were like raving about this. Let's try it. Now, I don't know whether it's because I don't have much, like, my taste buds are still not there yet with COVID. It's very bland. <laughs> oh my God. Do I actually like anything? Really? <laughs> Mm. It's nice. Very bland. It's a pop cake. Mm. It is nice. But it's not... <laughs> it's not packing a punch. <laughs> I need it to pack a punch, guys. I like my food with flavour. I reckon, I reckon, do you know, I reckon it's my taste buds. They're not, they're not there yet. I've heard that it takes like months for you to get the taste buds back. Um, when you have COVID. So I hope you enjoyed the little mukbang, guys, and the little catch up. Thank you for your support. We're at 2,000. We're at 20,100 now. Um, why is it I always get like messages when I'm filming? By the way, HRH is pregnant. I can't believe it. I was like, what? She's and it's a little girl as well. So cute. So congrats, HRH. Like, wow. She's been, you know, she's we wanted to get pregnant for so so long. So I really congratulate her. She's she's. I'm, I'm really happy for her like you know following someone from such a long time and then finally she's pregnant it's, it is so lovely i know she won't be watching this but hey anyway guys i love you all so much i'm gonna go now i hope you enjoyed the video i hope it wasn't too much for you i feel like i was all over the place as usual sorry about the hair touching you know it's what i do um oh my god i haven't even told you Stay tuned. Oh my God, I should have put this in the beginning. Oh no, because no one's going to know about this. Stay tuned watching my channel. By the way, guys, if you've watched this far, can you just put like a love heart? A red love heart. And please 
stay tuned because I am going to be in a documentary. I can't tell you what it's about or what, what channel it's on or anything like that. But it's happening and I will let you know when I know, obviously when it airs and stuff, it'll be in a, in a few months. Obviously it needs to be in production first. I've been trying to keep quiet about it because I don't want to count my chickens before the patch. You know, with production, things always change and stuff. And um, so, yeah. Why is my phone fading into black? What the fuck is going on? It's like dull, going duller. I think because my battery's dying. Anyway, guys, I love you all so much. And uh, thank you for all your support. And stay tuned for the documentary. Like, what? Stay tuned for the documentary. And I can't believe it, guys. I, I honestly, oh, all will become clear very soon. Um, and I love you all. Bye, guys. Why do I always do a stupid face? Bye, guys! <laughs>